So like, how I need to do this. Mm, mm, mm. Whatever, it's fine. Hey guys, I'm Sophie and I'm here with Student Beans. Today we're gonna be making a chicken and veg tray bake. For the dressing, you can do loads of different dressings. I like to do an easy variant on like a honey mustard dressing, but I like to use maple syrup because I just, I love it and I'll put it in anything I can. Let's do a bit of olive oil. Some mustard. I like to use grainy mustard just because it's got a little bit more texture. And a bit of paprika for color. And I like to put in a bit of cayenne pepper just for a little bit of heat. So this is gonna feel a bit gross, but I promise you it's worth it. If you wanted to do this veggie, you could do it with um, some halloumi instead. Okay, so the chicken's marinated. We're gonna let it sit there for a little bit and we're just gonna chop up our vegetables into roughly the same size so that they cook evenly. So we've got our veg. I'm gonna drizzle this in our veggie bowl. A nice, generous pinch of salt. Just gonna mix this up with our hands and bung the veg straight into the tray. I'm gonna do the potatoes now. And I like putting some thyme on um, my potatoes. And again, just give it a toss and into the tray. Chicken's gonna go in, um, but before I do, I'm gonna put a little squeeze of orange juice into the chicken marinade, because I usually like to do that actually with lemon, um, but I thought, you know what, oranges are nice and sweet. Let's try oranges this time. I'm also gonna put some um, orange slices in the tray, so it'll go in first for 35 minutes to roast, and then we'll take it out, have a look, put the orange slices in with the rest of the veggies, get a nice juice going, and put it in for another 15 minutes. Here we go. Chicken in. We're gonna put a couple sprigs of thyme in here and in the oven for 35 minutes, and then we'll give it a check. Great. Well, the veg looks nicely done. Oh, look how jammy those red onions look. I'm gonna squeeze a bit of orange on here. Get some more of that tangy flavor. And a little pinch of salt. Back in the oven. Oh, and it smells so good. It just smells so fresh and the sweetness from the red onions and the red peppers coming through. Yeah, I'm excited, this is great. And what's really nice about doing a tray bake is that it's easy to do. You put everything in in one go, so there's like minimal cleanup and you can keep it going for days. It's just so versatile and really delicious and relatively healthy for you. So give it a go. Cool, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, remember to like and subscribe and see you next time.